Well, if I dunked on Michael Jeffrey Jordan, I would tell the story to everybody that I came across. And you do the same thing. Let's watch Storytime with Jalen Rose. Now it's a distinct difference playing against Michael Jordan as he was leading the Bulls versus Michael Jordan, he's playing for the Wizards. I'm a Detroit native, a Piston fan, a Bad Boys fan. So when we were having our rivalries with the Bulls, the Pistons walked off the floor without shaking the Bulls' hands. So I was like, yeah, I love that. As a Detroiter, we had to be bad. We had to create rivals. We had to do something different, play with the big boys. So while I've always respected the greatness of Michael Jordan, I actually rooted against the Bulls because I was rooting for the Pistons. So now it's 1998, NBA Finals. Chicago Bulls at Utah Jazz. Jordan hits the shot against Byron Russell. He's retired. Cut to four years later. Jordan decides he wants to play again for the Wizards. So I remember playing against the sometimes I dream that he is me, Mike in Chicago. And then I'm playing against the guy for Washington. I'm like, he became more of the, I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. It wasn't every time. So I'm like, I can actually make some moves against this guy that he can't stop. So when we go to Washington, I'm in his face. So I'm taking him on the pole, jump hooking over him, scoring buckets. I had like 30 that game. I did a play and I actually dunked, not on him, but around him. And I was hanging on the rim and I started talking trash. I came down off the rim. I said something that you can't be repeated on our airways. It was very volatile, it was very rude and disrespectful. And I got ejected. Had 30 points late in the third quarter against Michael Jordan and the Wizards, I get ejected on national TV. That could have been the game of my life. When you have 30 points in the third quarter against Michael Jordan, what are you saying to yourself? I'm about to get 50. That's what I was saying. And I couldn't jump over a phone book as a player. So if I get a dunk and Michael Jordan's in the vicinity, I got pumped up and I got too pumped to where I got kicked out of the game. And that was stupid. <laughs> I love that you got kicked out. I think that makes the story even better than getting 50. Like, I dunked on Michael Jordan, got so excited that they wouldn't even leave, let me in the building anymore.